everyone, this is Crafterman, and welcome to another episode of Minecraft Green Plateau. And today I am starting in a very weird spot on the ledges uh, above my mob tower. So here's my mob tower, my partially functional mob tower. I shot a zombie off of there. It spawned like right up there. And yeah. So you can see a lot of my world from here. There is my tall building with games. I'm, gonna, I'm going to explain the blue in a second. There is my sand mining ravine. Here are my scorpions, grapefruit, orange, lime, and lemon. Uh, and trust me, I can tell them apart. So, oh, I never noticed this little cave here. I'll light it up, just to be safe. So... Good, we're in normal. I thought we were in peaceful because there were no mobs. Let's see, oh, you can like go down to that, the main cave. So now I'm going to explain the blue that was over there, because I needed tons of blue wool for that. You'll not believe how much I needed. But you know how? Okay, I'm not sure if you understood the game. And you probably didn't, so let me just go over it again, because I've made some major changes to it. It's no longer water flowing down a mountain. Basically, here's the scenario. You're in a submarine, underwater. The submarine has holes in it. And you have to find a safe spot from the water that's leaking in. So, the th um, um, person number one is going to be... For person number one and two, they're going to be, like, in the submarine trying to find a safe spot. And the third player is going to be under the submarine, making the water flow. So there are going to be three dispensers, three holes in the submarine, facing up. And you have to predict which spot, like, will be the least likely to get flooded. Or either that. Or, if it does get flooded, which will get the least flooded, because it, whoever has, like, less flood, because if the water's, like, really thick on your side, so where you're standing, then you would lose to someone whose water is, like, really thin. I'm making this sound really complicated, but it's not. So, I I'll show you instead of telling you. Uh... Oh, but, by the way, I packed sand sandwiches. I'm <laughs> speaking weird today for some reason. I have a mouth ache. <laughs> you can see the sunset right through that hole. So, I'm gonna put a door there, because I don't want Sandy and Express's room looking like snaz. That's just so I can get here quickly. Is that grapefruit? Grapefruit's been moving a lot lately. So, yeah, we'll just go down here, and let's get to work. I think I can just jump down, but first I have to scan for mobs. Scanning for mobs. Scan. Negative. We are in the semi- Oh! Never mind. Scan positive. There's a zombie. Die. Good. Oh, I have six levels already. I find that um, the more levels you have, the longer it takes to get hungry, and the faster you sometimes go. By the way, I enchanted my pickaxe. Paleontology 1. So, I hope there are no mobs in the des in the bamboo forest. Doesn't look like it. So, ah. If you're wondering what that blue thing is, that is the ocean. And I'm going to build my submarine inside it. It's, you're not going to really see water. It's going to be really obvious that it's just blue wool, not water, but it has to look somewhat like a submarine, so. I'm going to use my axe to break dirt. Yeah, it took me a really long time to shear all my sheep, and I even had to dye my white sheep blue. Let's see, I'll have an apple jam sandwich. Uh, ah, this is stale. Oh, right, I made this in episode 15, and this is episode, what, 91, I think, eh. That's all I have, I'll just have to deal. Um, okay, I'm gonna shovel away the ground. 
Uh, I think it works with better with this kind of dirt. I think this is like podzol. Like the kind of dirt you get when you hoe the ground, but a different kind of it. I don't know. It's what it's the dirt you find in the bamboo forests. I wish I had silk touch so I could find out what it is. Shoveled up some leaves. Actually, that could work. So now what I gotta do is I gotta put the stone down. And I'm gonna make a checkered pattern. So this is actually gonna be a dispenser. No, wait, never mind. Not that. Uh. Oh, yeah, before I do anything, I have to do the walls. So, yeah, it's gonna go all the way around here. And let's do the floor. Yeah, the dispenser is right over here. Over here. Good, hopefully. So then the floor is going to be a checkered pattern of stone and quicksand. Why the heck am I using quicksand? It's so that the, what, what do you call it? The players, they can stay in their spot while the water flows over so they don't like, the water doesn't move them, and then they forget where they were, so. Actually, may, I wonder if I actually need the quicksand. Maybe I can just have it like this. Yeah, I don't need the quicksand. That's a little too <laughs> gruesome. Okay, now I just need to block all of this off so the water doesn't flow outside. I don't want a flood in the bamboo forest. Then I'm going to wash down all the trees. <laughs> wash down. Actually, I should be using stone for this. Um, yeah. Actually, let's just do quicksand for now. And see how it goes. Because otherwise the water will get everywhere. Or maybe not. Changing my mind too quickly, so I'll use the quicksand for something else, like maybe a mob trap in my mob tower. My deluxe, partially functional mob tower. Yeah. So, after that, I'm gonna get rid of them. Maybe I'll have to put blue wool down here, too. Oh, it's gonna be just pee. Okay. You know what? I'm just gonna make all the floors dirt. So yeah, this may take a while. And this will be another boring video that you're forced to watch because for whatever reason, but Okay, I think this is good now. Eh, fell out. Even though this doesn't look anything like a submarine, it's fairly acceptable. Which is almost fantastic. Yay. So, put this here. Put this here. And make the checkered pattern. Again, let's see. This is supposed to be 12. So, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. That's what the game is going to be, and then this is just going to be like the steering place, like the where the pilot of the submarine... Do submarines have pilots? Well, what, whoever drives it, I guess. So is the sun setting? It might be. Let me just quickly check. No, not at all. Alright, I slept. I forgot. So now I just have to do the walls like this. So then the center is going to be white wool. Eh, whoops. Let's let's just do it from up here. It's gonna be a lot quicker. I think I might have a little more white wool than I need. And then I get I don't need this these torches. I have to get rid of them. And I left some glass smelting in Sandy and Express's room. So I'm just going to get that for the windows. Just going to be looking out into some blue wool. That'll be better than nothing, I guess. 
So I'm gonna, maybe we'll have some white wool for the ceiling. I'm somewhat am improvising for the design of the submarine. So... Oh, I totally forgot. I do not need these here. Actually, I can't have these here. So stone goes here. And then the white wool goes on top of it. Come on. Up, up, up. Good. Bulb. And then the stone goes on top of that. Good. So, these three dispensers, well, it's only one so far, but they're going to be three. Um, the per You're not supposed to try and predict which one the player on the bottom will activate because that's too hard to guess. What you're really supposed to do is just, like, try and, like, figure out which is the least likely to get flooded or which will have the least flooding, or maybe both. So, uh, I, yeah, I have buckets. Good. So, saying so, so much. Like I said... Good, now the rest of this will be glass after this. Place, and, oops, and place. Then the center will be glass, which reminds me, yeah, I gotta go get Sandy and Express's stuffs. Do you think I can make it all the way up there? Ah. My diamond armor is barely wearing out, which is weird because I'm getting hurt so many times. Is it only the boots that wear out if you fall, or what? Can, okay, let's climb up here, I guess. Hopefully this will be a way up, because otherwise it'll just be a waste of time climbing up. So, this... I can't see. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, I gotta make a bit of a jump. Maybe I can make a cool loop. You know, I'm just going to take the long way around. That will be easier. Oh, there are bamboo trees even up here. Wow. Okay, let's go. I hope I don't fall into my mom tower. That will be very ironic, dying the way. Oh, that was scary. Let's see, the sun is starting to set now, which will be good. Maybe I'll sleep again in Kaboominator's bed, because, I mean, a sleeping bag, because it's fun. Sleep in there. Oh, you just forced to sleep on your stomach when you sleep there, and whenever I sleep on my stomach in Minecraft, and in real life, I have weird dreams. So... Oh, that ravine looks so cool with the sunlight, and you can see all the torches. Now, let's go over to Kaboominator's room. My mom's tower has gotten a lot of mobs underneath it lately, and no mobs in it. So here is the dog house, and here is the good house. I mean, Kaboominator's bedroom. And here's his bed. Time to sleep. <laughs> Okay. That dream was weird. Wait a second. I think that was Mr. 37 who was out there. Um, I've been having some dreams off camera too about like what's happened to the virus after I left it, but yeah, it's just a dream. I'm not going to worry about it. Okay, now I open the trap door with the arrow. Ah. Come on, get it. 
open the trap door with the air. Well, let's just go down and leave the trap door open. Okay, that challenge enough time. Ah, need to get my arrow. My <laughs> time to go back to the place. What's it called? The tall building with games. Yeah, let's go there. I'm gonna have my next sandwich. Hmm, well, the strawberry one's kept. Well, um, where's a safe place to jump? Okay, uh, I'm saying okay so much. Scanning for mobs. Scan negative so far. Scanning, scanning, jumping. Scanning again. Scanning. Well, there's always this underwater snake. Well, it was underwater. Are you poisonous? I mean, venomous, sorry. Poisonous is if the poison gets injected if they're touched or eaten. Let's go up. Oh, I forgot to get that glass. Totally. That's why I went there in the first place. Oh, well. We'll just have to go all the way back up. That was just pee. You know what? I'm going to cut this out for you guys until I get there. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys. I'm back. Got the glass. Scan negative. Jump. Wait, was it? Yeah, good. And now let's go back, hopefully. Yeah. So, if you don't understand the game, brief recap, you have to find a safe spot. The end. Done. Good. So, let's go over there. What's taking so long? I feel like I'm tripping on everything I... Yes, yeah, see? When I really want to go somewhere. I should have made some sort of elevator. I need to make some sort of um mechanism of getting up in the tall building with games. We're only on game one, and this is already it's Nas. Okay, it's going into here. Where should I have the windows? Side windows? Maybe they'll be every three blocks. Maybe. Ah, I fell in. One here. One, two, actually every four blocks, sorry. One here, and one, two, three, and, eh. And one here. So now, you're supposedly looking into ocean. Deep ocean, where things live. <laughs> I should have made this on the some of the blocks that aren't like that. Uh, what do I not need? I do not need sand. Okay, where's the white wool? Here it is. And one over here. Okay, here's our submarine, guys. Get out my dirt. And have another strawberry jam sandwich. Hmm, that takes me back. I think I've gotten over my sandwich hatred that I caused in the crazy clinic. Come on, please, right place, right place. No. I hate breaking glass. Alright, put down. Good. I can't hate it when I can't put down glass. It's a real put down. <laughs> Terrible pun. Uh, hopefully there's... I, I was going to say there's nowhere else where I could put it, but... Yeah, I'm wrong. So, put, put, mm, putting things everywhere. Oh, I could just do this. That was stupid. So, and then I shovel this up. The dirt. Here's my shovel. It's running low. Gotta be careful. And then I replace all this with stone. It doesn't really look like I'm underwater now because I'm surrounded by all of this other snaz. And there are torches there too. I should get rid of those. Maybe they'll be 
mobs. I can pretend there's sea monsters or something. That would be kind of cool. Actually, that would be really cool. Maybe I'm going to replace this with stone off camera. So, well, this too. Okay, now I'm going to put down the dispensers. Uh, pickaxe. The other dispenser is going to be on the opposite side. Wait, is this 12? Yeah, I think it is. Oh yeah, I should put it here, that's what. So then I'm going to put these, I'm going to fill these buckets with water and put them in. So, count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is where I put the next dispenser. Good. So now, the only thing that's left to do is to find a safe spot. So, I need some cobblestone. I found the stone, but not cobblestone. Well, here's some. I'm gonna... Oh, I have some levers, so I'm just gonna combine this with a stick. No, it's the other way. Sorry. I have three levers now. I'm gonna get some water. Bucket of water. Let's go, 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 go. Mm. Eh. There's an endless water source down here. One, uh, at, let me just get this quick, rid of this quicksand. I have plenty of that in my world. Two, and, uh, what can I get rid of? I can combine all of this, I guess, yeah. Great. So let's go back up and put the stuff down. And then right before I end the episode, I'm going to... Find a safe spot. So now I'm just going to predict which will be the safest spot, then choose which one of these dispensers afterwards. Okay. Which will be the safest spot? Most least likely to get wet, and if it does, the least wet. Well, this has a ra they all have a range of eight, I believe, yeah. Oh, I do need to put down quicksand. That was stupid. I got rid of all of them. So... I do need to put down quicksand because otherwise, see, um, it would just fall into there, see? That wouldn't be very fun, would it? So yeah, I have to put down some quicksand. Okay, guys, so I'm going to end this episode here. And my next episode, I'm going to finish... Actually, I'm going to finish it off camera. I'm just going to play, find a safe spot with my friends if they join me, and if they don't, then I'm going to be building the next game. What is it? Watch my next episode to find out. I am Crafterman, and I am wet.